What's going on, everybody? Mr. Lux, aka the Merry Gamer, bringing you another player lock today uh, from a player that's been requested by a lot of people as of late, and this is Edwin Encarnacion of the Toronto Blue Jays. But we playing the Open A's out at uh, O. Co. Coliseum. See the records there. This is played in the show live mode. I also get a lot of people asking me on, in the comments about how am I player locking during the show live. And I'm going to show you how I do it. Uh, because you can't select your player before you actually start the game. So I'm going to show you how you do player lock in show live. Alright, so this is how you do player lock in show live. So you have to actually wait till the game starts. And you go into substitutions and this is where you select your player. So we're doing Edwin Car in Encarnacion. So I hit R2, you get the same prompt as you would if you were doing it from the exhibition mode, and then you're player locking as this person. Now, if you're somebody that doesn't want to like break up the game to go and select it, you can easily go to exit game and, and select restart. And when the game restarts, you'll begin the game already player locked. So that's how you do it in show live. And then once you do that, you get back to this menu and you're ready to begin. All right. So that's my quick tutorial, a little bonus Edwin footage for this player lock. We'll take his cuts now. First baseman, Edwin Encarnacion. All right. Edwin Encarnacion. What a name. This is on the PS4. Sometimes I have to say that because I posted a video yesterday that was for the, it was done on the PS3 because I still have both copies of the game. I have both copies of the game still because um, I got a good deal on the PS4 version because I originally bought the PS4 returned it because I liked the PS3 better then a good deal came on the PS4 so I said what the heck and I think I'm actually using the default uh, batting camera angle and not my normal catcher too Started to go around there, and it'll cost him, as they say. He did swing Oh that man, come on! I just swing that. Look at all these pitches. That's horrible. All of them are low. Easy there, big oh, fella. Two good pitch. Two. Four pitches. And he's gonna fall his way back. Slow, I'm fast, impressed. Slow. EK, you thinking fastball here? Right, let's look at the pitches. They're all been low. He's probably gonna go back low again. Guys will catch on quick. And that swung on and fouled straight back. We actually did not go low. Oh, I knew that's what happened. But he'll try for first on the drop third strike. Well, I tell you, that catcher has some massive quick reflexes, man. He's lightning quick. All right, let's try to do better this time, Edwin. Edwin Encarnacion will try it again. 26 homers this year. Strikes his first time. One thing I like about doing player lock in the show live mode is that your performance actually updates their stats real time so his batting average right now is showing at a 280 but it wasn't a 280 at the beginning of the game it's because I struck out so that's what happens and a change up here misses off the corner to start him out it's ball one all right so at least we're winning it's top of the fourth That's how you come back from the strikeout. You get right back on that horse and just beat it to death. Probably wasn't a good analogy. I may have Peter on my back after that comment. So a solo home run for Edwin Encarnacion. And that is 27 for him on the year as the Blue Jays take a 2 to nothing advantage. That was good. That was a good hit, though. Well, even though they were able to face this guy, look at him. Look, good lord. Two outs, base is empty. That was a perfect swing. I mean, that was a, a perfect timing of a swing because whenever you can, if you're a right handed batter, whenever you can get the ball like over right, uh, left center, uh, that means you got pretty much all your power around on that swing. Nate Fryman, he actually started first base at the beginning of the game. I'm not sure what happened to the original first baseman. Yeah, they pretty much had to sit on their hands all afternoon. 
Not a lot to get All right, we so in the far. outfield. Let's play a little deep. Credit to that man out there on the mound. He's cut right through this lineup for the first four innings. Swing and a ball bounced back up the middle. Throws in time, and that's out number one. And on the mound, he hasn't found himself in too many rough spots so far, so this might be his first real test of the ball game. All right, let's field it. Let's field it. Throw it. Oh, get up, get on the. Oh man, what happened? Ah, oh, I guess I was a little too twitchy on the thumbstick. I was, I couldn't get on the bag. Same person again, Nate Freeman, Freeman, whatever the name is. For the third time now, he struck out and bounced out in his first two trips. Swing and a ground ball towards the hole. Oh man! And despite being down 0-2, he delivers anyway with a big base hit. Crap! And Come on, guys, let's settle in, settle down now, settle down, settle down. Sergio Santos, 0-2 record, five saves out of 16 games, ERA 6.87. I don't like our chances with this guy. Look at that home run. As soon as he get in, wow. That is crazy. Well, this game has kind of turned a little upside down. Now we're losing by six. As soon as we put that freaking guy in to um, that relief pitcher in that had that horrible record, he gets belted for like a three or four shot home run. Swinging a ground ball to short. And an underhanded throw is in time for out number three. All right, we got to do some more damage, guys. Maybe the best fans in what are they doing? What is it? What are they? I've never seen this before. What are they doing? <laughs> what in the world was that? These fools are getting crunk up in the stadium. Man, that is crazy. This game always throws little nuggets out at you. I have a video on my... If you guys go back and look at my Paul Goldschmidt player lock, at, at some point during the game, a fan supposedly ran out on the field and they've called attention to it during the game. It's crazy. And he'll look at a first pitch curveball that's in the dirt. It's yeah, this game loves to put little tips. If you just leave the game running when you're like in the outfield and, and not doing anything, it has a lot of cool things that happen. Line hard to the left side. But you see a lot of crazy little cutscenes. A lot of them are funny too. I right, come on, Edwin. One and one. Now here's a ball. Good hit. Good hit. Short. And that's through into left. So a leadoff single here to start the seventh. All right. Well, we got to start somewhere. Yeah, it was doing his, his part. Second hit so far, but he's got two of their four hits. So at least he's seeing the ball well. That's right. The start this is when your team's on a losing streak. He has been phenomenal. On the move again from first. Pitch inside the throw. Yeah, it's easy to steal that guy. He has a really slow windup. Well, I think he's pretty lucky to get in there safely on this play. It's a decent get in there safely. Come on, man. I mean, Edwin may not be a base stealer. I'm not really sure what his wheels are like, but I know I had that easy. Steven, we need you. Two ground outs is not going to cut it. So is your batting average. Now a sharply hit ball back up the Come on. And that's in there. Base hit. No, no, no. Being waved on home. Oh, man. I could have made it. In here, and that'll force the runner to hold at third base. Darren Mastriani. Swinging a ball hit softly on the ground. Throw on yeah. the in time, and the Toronto rally goes for naught as the inning is over. Blue Jays leave a pair. Todd Redmond will come on now in a mop up roll as he'll just try and keep. John Jaso will get another shot now. Two for three in the game. John Jaso. Now a swing and a ball grounded to second. There's one. There we go. and it's in time for the double play. There we go. Nice double play. Over. Four to six to three. They roll it up. Let's check this out again.
back with more fun here on a Friday afternoon. Scoop it, this. toss it, bear harm it, bear hand it actually, and then throw him out. Nice. All right, here we go. Edwin, we need you, buddy. That averages up to 284. Now he has 27 home runs. So I like the real-time stats adjustments like I talked about earlier. It's pretty cool. That's why it's fun to play player locks in the show live mode. You get, you get special graphics and banners when certain things happen. All right, here we go. Top of the ninth. Outside target here, and he hits it. Good pitch. One. Right field. Ah, uh, that's not going anywhere. Vote will come Dang. to and put it away for the second. Came in on me. All righty, well, the team was not successful in this game, although Edwin did a good job. Two for four, one home run. A uh, single, and I think also a stolen base, if I'm not mistaken. Let's check it out here. Uh, yep, Encarnacion, 2-4, scored a run, uh, RBI, which is all from the home run. Struck out once, but he definitely got a uh, stolen base, which will give him his third for the year, so there you go. Hope you guys enjoyed this player lock. Like I said, I had a lot of people request for this guy, so... Uh, Went ahead and, and bumped him up the list for you. Consider it my gift to you on this special July 4th. So until the next video, I'm Mr. Lux, a.k.a. The Merry Gamer, and I'm out. Peace.